Hey, what's going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today, we're going to check it out how to create this isometric cube made out of letter T in Adobe Illustrator. Also, if you want to check out how I made these and support the channel, you can join the YouTube members only page and select secret content to watch more premium videos where you can learn advanced tricks and methods in order to become a better designer. Now, let's get back to our tutorial. First step, we're gonna need the stroke. I'm gonna click on the fill, click on the non, click on the stroke. I'm gonna select the black color. I'm gonna select the pen tool and I'm gonna create a line. Press and hold shift, press and hold alt, click on the line, drag it, press control D a lot of times to create a lot of copies. Select them all, right click group. I'm gonna select the D, rotate tool, double click on the rotate tool, type in 60 degrees click on copy and then press control D. Now in this situation, as you can see, it, it aligned it perfectly. Not all the time it's going to align it perfectly. All you need to do is select the pen tool, create a line where basically it intersects at this crossing point and select the line and also select the rest of the lines and click up here to horizontal line right. And it's gonna align it perfectly and you also remove that little line there. Good, I'm gonna select them all, right click group, I'm gonna decrease the stroke. Okay, now I'm gonna click somewhere here. I'm gonna go to the stroke. I'm gonna increase the stroke to two. I'm gonna select the pen tool again and I'm gonna start drawing. I'm gonna make a letter T made out of two triangles. Do it like this. Top part is gonna be made out of uh, six triangles. There you go. Two more triangles. Now we're gonna do with four triangles like that. And now I'm gonna make the 3D part. Now this side is going to be a little bit more tricky. We will need to make the full size. We're just gonna make the half of this 3D effect here. And we're gonna need this space empty. So I'm gonna delete uh, the grid. I'm gonna select them all, right click group. Now it's also, it's a little bit more edgy. You can go to the stroke and decrease the limit, or you just make the corner rounded. Now I'm gonna select the rotate tool. I'm gonna press and hold alt and click at this anchor point right here and I'm gonna type in 120 degrees, click on copy and then press Control D to create another copy. And this is how you make this cube made out of letter T's. Thanks for watching and if you're new on the channel don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a great one, bye bye.